Hello YouTube, welcome to my channel. I'm so glad you're here. Here are my top cleaning supplies. I use these products like every day. These aren't in any particular order as to which is my favorite and least favorite because they all do different things. Some natural, some not so natural. This is just gonna give you a look into my cleaning closet and show you the kind of supplies that I use. Here we go. Bleach. I cannot live without this product. I know what you guys are thinking. It's just for bathrooms. Guys, bleach is not just for bathrooms. It has to be splashless. Bleach cleans. It's just, I know we're on this whole natural products kick, and don't worry, I have some natural products for you guys as well that I use, but for me, bleach, it's so versatile, and when I'm done, I know that it's clean. Lysol disinfectant spray. You can use it in your kitchen, in your bathroom, doorknobs, great smell. Just read the instructions because the directions are very clear. Um, I don't even think about that anymore, but yeah, I guess there is a right and wrong way to use uh, Lysol. The Mr. Clean Liquid Muscle and the Mr. Clean All-Purpose or Multi-Purpose Cleaner. The Liquid Muscle is a liquid gel concentrate. The scent is by Febreze and it's meadows and rain. You see how much I've used of this. However, I've had this um, for almost two years. So, I mean, it lasts a long time, but I use it all the time. Sometimes you just wanna get it clean. You're sitting there and you're trying to scrub, scrub, scrub. Dude, this does the job for you. No scrubbing, just wipe it, just wipe it away. There are two ways that you can use this. First way is to dilute it. Second way is to put it directly onto the sponge, just doop. You know it really needs some some cleaning and some some liquid muscle so there you go the second one is this mr. clean uh, multi-purpose cleaner and it's lavender what is it lavender vanilla comfort so the same scent that it's that's in the um, the Swiffer wet jet purple it smells so good and it just it cleans that's the thing about both these products is that they don't leave residue. Use plenty of water. Don't, um, with any cleaning product, you should use plenty of water, hot water if, if possible. You don't ever want to leave just like a film of cleaning solution. It builds up, it actually attracts more dirt, more work for you in the long run. Just don't do it. Um, yeah, just don't do it. Another product that I am obsessed with is scrubbing bubbles bathroom cleaner it just takes all the work out of cleaning the bathroom which is my least favorite place to clean we're dirty human beings are dirty human beings are dirty creatures so it's actually a disinfectant as well um, which is great I don't have to come back in with bleach if I use this product it has a nice lemon scent to it that ring that's around your tub just spray it and the best part is you can spray it like upside down you can spray it you know straight forward um, once you spray it just let it sit for maybe five minutes and rinse it off I kid you not that's it that's it that's all you have to do it's great another all-purpose cleaner that I am in love with is Fabuloso so <laughs> if you do not already know about Fabuloso let me tell you something you're missing out First of all, the smell. This is probably not healthy. It just smells like clean house, clean room, clean, clean. <laughs> like when you smell Fabuloso, you know someone's cleaning, you know? It doesn't just smell like a candle. It smells like the place is clean, and I love that. Um, but besides the smell, it actually does a really good job of cleaning. It, it really does and you can clean not, I feel like I use it more so in on like the kitchen floor than anything but it's a multi-purpose cleaner you can use it in your bathroom 
You can use it on the floors. You can use it on the stove. You can use it, this looks like a nightstand. Mm, coffee table. <laughs> you can use it in your living room. But seriously guys, this product here, um, it's a staple. You just gotta have it. I don't always use it, but I mean, you can see it's not at the top, so it's definitely being used. I probably have like, let's see, probably have like half left based on the shadow here. Um, and I've had this, I don't know. I probably got it before the Mr. Clean. <laughs> so you don't even need a lot, that's the best part. Just sprinkles, little capful. Like, do not overuse it because there's a difference between like, it smelling clean and it smelling like cleaning products. You don't want that. Easy off. This is a very versatile product. I know that most people think that this is just for ovens. Um, it's not, and this is the heavy duty one, and it says cleans tough baked on spills quickly. Um, so it cleans in five minutes. The five minutes is with the heat, so if you wanna spray down, let's say your oven, and you wanna turn on the oven to, you're supposed to preheat it, I think, actually to 200, and then you spray it, and then you close it, and you let it sit for five minutes. You know, that's one way to go about it. Um, I actually recently cleaned um, one of the burners on my stove top with this. Um, and now I kind of want to clean them all. <laughs> so I will, I will try and like post a picture here. Somewhere here, I said here and then I said here. There's gonna be a picture somewhere. <laughs> Look at that. Look at that. So this is definitely a product that I would recommend you have on hand. Thanksgiving, perfect example. Thanksgiving is coming up. Oh, and you gotta just, you know, cook, cook, cook. And it's hard to stop and clean. And what happens is the sweet potato is dripping at the bottom of the oven. Milk and cheese, and you can't clean until like the day is over. It's gonna be tough to clean off. It's just gonna be a headache. Little angel just flying in to save you. <laughs> This is also not sponsored. Probably should have said that in the beginning. <laughs> My next product is a must. Um, we have tons of windows. I don't even, we have like 28, 29 windows in the house. Also our um, dining table. We have lots of glass. It's by Sprayway. And this is the best glass cleaner I have ever used. Hands down, hands down best glass cleaner I've ever used. No residue, great smell, ammonia free. That's about it, but it's great. <laughs> it's great, I mean, what else could you ask for in a glass cleaner, right? Now let's get into the natural cleaning products that I use. And the first is Nature's Promise. Um, Nature's Promise. This one is the hardwood floor cleaner and it's in citrus blossom scent. It smells really good, it smells like orange and flowers kind of like an orangey cream kind of smell one thing about this product though is you really do have to dilute it if you don't use enough water then it kind of like it will kind of cause little start to cause little like pools in your wood yeah it's pretty good i like it i use it pretty regularly and of course myers okay so about 90% of you probably have already heard of Myers products. Here are just a few. As you can see, like this, this, um, this is hand soap and it's the um, honeysuckle scent. Love it. And it's pretty much empty. This is my dish soap and I'm pretty, I, I'm pretty religious about sticking to the rosemary. I love it, I love it. The only other one that I am that obsessed with is the basil scent. I do know about the pumpkin and the apple cider and the mum. Don't like any of those for fall. Um, I have not tried the peppermint for winter yet, and I'm kind of scared to. I kind of feel like I just won't like it and it's gonna give me a headache. Maybe I should just go to like Target or something and try it. This one is lemon verbena scented. I actually just used it recently to clean out my refrigerator. This worked well. Yeah, I mean, no residue, it, it was great. Yeah, I'd use it again. I actually liked it better um, in my refrigerator than, so this is a tub and tile cleaner, right? But 
like I hardly ever use it in the bathroom. Uh, I definitely don't use it in my tub. The third natural product that I have here is by Method. And it is the Method Power Dish Dishwasher Detergent Packs. They look like this. I'm gonna like break one of them. They look like this. It has a rinse aid action. It removes 48 hours stuck on food and it targets tough food stains. I was so weary of this and um, the only reason I got it was because I am very particular when it comes to my dishes. Because we had gotten this like big jar of Cascade and then this like Cascade Rinse Aid stuff. But this Method product here, it's so great. Better than any other uh, dishwasher liquid I've ever used. Um, way better than Cascade. And my dishes glistened, like the glasses shine. I don't know if Myers has any. I don't know if there's any other natural dishwashing ones. I guess I'm willing to try them. Um, if you know of any, uh, comment below. Let me know so I could try them, I guess. I definitely want to know what you guys clean with. Wait, I totally forgot because, okay. How can you clean without gloves? Mm -hmm. Uh, these are actually disposable gloves. You might recognize these from the latest episode of Grey's Anatomy. Scalpel. The reason why I went um, disposable with my gloves is because I use them for cooking, and I use them for cleaning, and I use them for um, Bella sometimes when I have to groom her. I've, I've purchased the um, multi-use gloves. They always rip, they always get a hole in them or a tear in them. Somehow water still gets you know, like they like come to here and then you're like, how? <laughs> you're like in the sink cleaning dishes and you're like, how did did water get all the way in there from all the way up there when the water stops? Like it just doesn't make sense. There's like micro holes in them that, you know, just. So these are just a great alternative for me. Actually, they are doctor's gloves. I actually, get them from my local doctor's office. And all I do is ask if I can have a box of gloves. If you don't wanna do that, like, Corey always looks at me like, <laughs> sometimes like he wants me to wait until like he leaves the room so I can ask, cause he's like a little embarrassed. No shame, no shame. You do what you need to do to save a dollar. But if you don't wanna go that route, um, you can always order them. If you're not boycotting Amazon like I am, then you can order them off of Amazon. Probably Walmart too, you can get them. I mean, just, yeah, like in the medical section. When I'm cooking, I hate the garlic smell that stays on your fingers. I pop on these gloves and I don't have to smell garlic for the rest of the day. So, so win-win. Plus, you can do this. <laughs> if you have cleaning products um, that I didn't list here that you think I should try, list them below. Especially the natural products. I am trying to use more natural products. So guys, I really hope you enjoyed this video. Stay tuned, stay connected, like this video, subscribe, and I will see you next time. Does anyone else's child stuff their mouth full of food? Mine does. Your food, Myla.